Hi everyone, it's Adam here from Ads Productions with an overview of some of the features that are on Synology Disk Station Manager 6.1 and above. So that I can make use of Seagate's IronWolf health management system that's included in these hard drives, I'm going to be installing two 6TB IronWolf NAS hard drives. USB Copy 2.0 this allows you to customize the import and export rules for quick backup solutions to and from a USB device that's plugged into the front or the back of the NAS drive. For example, if you wanted to take a copy of a few shares that are on the NAS drive, all you have to do, plug the USB drive in, and as long as you've got a scheduled task and or you've pressed the copy button on the front, it will do its thing, allowing for a seamless backup solution. In this instance, I set the settings to make sure that every weekday at 7 p.m. a specific share was copied to the external hard drive. You can also customize the copy button on the front of the NAS. This will allow for a simple solution of plug the drive in, press the button, the rules will apply. If there's a scheduled task, it will happen. Job done, no messing around. You can also choose exactly the types of files you'd like to archive, even based on the file extension or Word documents, audio, video, you name it, you can choose whether or not you'd like to back it up. Universal search is probably my favorite feature of 6.1. This allows you to search files, folders, anything you can think of, audio, video, text files, images, on the whole entire NAS drive through every single share. One thing you have to make sure of is that your folders are indexed. The reason they have to be indexed is so that they can be searched. To index, all you have to do is create the indexed folder by clicking a few buttons, specifying the folders you wish to index, and that's it. You can search for anything and it will appear within the results window. For this example, I had to find a script that was hidden in a certain folder. All I typed in was script and there it was. It really is damn easy to find files now on your NAS drive. Iron Wolf Health Management. This is an exclusive software that runs on the Synology NAS, basically designed to keep track of all your drives and how they're doing. This may seem like a very basic thing on the surface, but I can assure you it is not by any means. In summary, it looks at the environmental and usage conditions such as temperature, the vibrations going on, certain shocks, anything you can think of. It also looks at hundreds and hundreds of details and these are analyzed to recommend backup ahead of catastrophic data loss events. So for example, it might spot patterns that are frequently known to mean, okay, something's gonna go wrong soon. It will jump in and say, back your stuff up because your drive is about to fail. It's just advanced backup and data loss prevention technology. It has what Seagate describes as adaptive algorithms that monitor the critical drives and their health parameters related to overall performance and or reliability. It will say, do you need to do any more diagnostics? And if a backup is necessary or not. On top of this, certain Seagate Pro drives actually come with what's known as the Rescue Plus system, which allows you to send the drive away and get it looked at by data recovery professionals. It's not included on the Seagate standard IronWolf hard drives, but it is included on the Pro version. If you look online, the Rescue Plus plans are fairly cheap, so you'd be kind of foolish not to go for them despite the minor cost. In summary, it will look at the drives and say, okay, are these drives okay? If the drives report that they're okay, it will still look further into them to check all of the algorithmic data, as well as some warning signs that may potentially lead to catastrophic data loss, which is something nobody wants. So that has been a quick overview of some of the features that are included on Synology's Disk Station Manager 6.1 and above. If you have any questions about any of these features that are on the NAS drive, please feel free to leave me a comment below and I'll do my best to answer you. Thank you very much for watching. This has been Adam from Ads Productions.